Reggie Jackson. Up top to a wide open Paul George for three. Book it. Great patient possession. Information for you, but when I do, you will be the first to know. George, not this time. A block out of bounds by P.J. Washington. Let me help you. With Especially problem. alongside you in the rare moments that I get to chime in. <laughs> George to the cup. Oh, we have liftoff here in downtown Los Angeles. We're at nine points, 25 points, and then a pair of seven-point games, including that loss to the Lakers the other night. Jackson, a great look at a three, and he continues to smolder now 21 of his last 39 from distance. Marcus Morris Sr. feeling very good after his Jayhawks were winners earlier today in the NCAA tournament. Two-man game. Zoo into the paint. Comes up on the other side and lays it in. He's averaging just six points per game over the last five. It's about half of what he had been averaging. Paul George walked into a three. Second three-pointer for George. As we switched the first passing of offensive players and then the big man screened and rolled right into him we'll take that one from paul george knock it down the three from behind the line the clippers are four and one in the previous five they go to their cash cow he floats it up and in again paul george is five of six from the field how he adapts i'm assuming it'll be very well here for the clippers in that second unit how about a dunk from patrick patterson to start things off here in the second quarter 41 to 21 here in the first half Hornets on this season, 0 and 10 when trailing by 20 or more. Right, Hayward challenged inside, throws it away. PG leads the break with Patterson riding shotgun, gets it to Patterson, and he flushes it in with a right hand. Play well, maintain this type of a lead, and one of your best players on the team hasn't had to do very much other than be a part of it. Almost feels like that on both sides. Senior gives to George. Two defenders running out of misfires. Clippers still lead by 18. Probably for every trade that does get made, there are 30 that didn't go through. Hayward for three. Misses badly. And George with a leaping rebound. That didn't go through. Hayward for three. Misses badly. And George with a leaping rebound. Lob to Leonard. Oh, my. Nice feed into Zubats, takes a dribble and lays it home. Ball deflects the ball to Bridges, turnover Clippers. And crashing back the other way, ball will go to the line for a couple of free throws. And as you mentioned, they have done a wonderful job over the last few years of finding free agents that fit what they're trying to do. George for three, offline, Zoo chases down the rebound. That fit what they're trying to do. George for three. Offline. Zoo chases down the rebound. George reloads and hits the target this time. George now. George. Oh, knocks it in. 66 to 44 with 1.4 to play here in the first half. And the Hornets. One barely got to the rim, and the second was short about a foot and a half. So I wondered if they'd play him or not to start the second half. He's in the lineup now, and he watches Marcus Morris Sr. knock down the triple. Throw off the chemistry the following year. George, strong drive. Oh, he got a foul call, and the band sings hallelujah. And Paul George will go to the free throw. He doesn't have a real dialogue with anybody in, that, in the uh, league offices, I should say. And Paul George gets up and down on the three-point play. George spoon feeds Zoo and he flushes it in. A trailer three for Lou, not there. Ball with the rebound doesn't have numbers. He doesn't care. A whistle and a foul as he collides. Hornets came into the game at 20 and 20, sixth in the Eastern Conference. That's the cutoff line this year for the play-in game. When you finish in that top 10, you're going to have an opportunity to get into the playoffs. George into Batum and lays it in, counted on a foul. Clippers, hopefully they're not concerned about making the playoffs. They're worried about where they're going to be seated. And they have an opportunity in front of them, these final 30 games, this one included. Strong drive, Martin, hesitation, flings a three nevertheless. 
Nine minutes to play in this one. Man. Oh, with a flush. 105 to 80. Timeout. And I, for one, am very much looking forward to it. 107, 81. Ball crashing into defenders. A whistle and a foul. I'll be quiet. Now, the only time I remember a designer, and she wasn't even a designer, she was an athlete that was into fashion. Was yeah, they have been sharing the Staples Center with the Lakers for the last couple of decades, but before that, their building was the L.A. Sports Arena. I remember some of the oh, oh, Nick some of the players. You said they had ten different practice facilities in one season. It is not a law firm. It is brother to brother there for Charlotte. This is Malik Monk. He'll hoist up a deep three. 